I cannot stand bots. Whether it be scam callers or these little porn bots on Instagram or whatever, they are so annoying. First off, let's start off with scam callers. Almost every single day, I get calls about we are calling in regards to your vehicle's extended warranty. And I was like, you know what? Like, I don't have no warranty, at least I don't know, but you can take that extended warranty and just <clears throat> And then I also get like, we have been trying to reach you in regards. I'm like, well, you we haven't been trying very hard because this is the first call I'm getting. Or another one about, oh, we are calling. Uh, this is an apology call from your Duke Energy bill. I'm like, oh, an apology call? Uh, I don't even have Duke Energy. You know, I've been getting these calls ever since I had a, a cell phone back when I was like 13, 14 years old. What is a little 13, 14 year old having Duke Energy in the first place? The main bots I wanted to talk about are all the time you see on Instagram or on Twitter, mostly on Instagram. That's I deal with them all the time. I never deal with them on YouTube and never deal with them on Twitter or on Instagram. It's so annoying. Not as much as I used to be getting them, but every once in a while, I'll always, always, always get added to some dumb chat, and it's all and you could tell it's a bot because the person. You, can barely speak a lick of English and it's always like some dumb like catchphrase I can see what they're trying to say but it's always like hey follow me come chat with me oh hey now I'm boring I've literally seen those before but every once in a while you'll get these ones that are like kind of convincing you know the ones that like disguise themselves as like actual accounts these the other ones that are so obvious, like even like dumbasses can tell they're fake. But these ones, you you have to like kind of think about it for a minute. Because you can tell, you know, they have like a lot of followers and whatever. And so today, I get this one girl messaging me. I get a follow request from this one girl. Now, I look at her account and I see that she's following a bunch of people that I follow. And a bunch of people that I know are following her. Because on Instagram, it shows the blank blank so and so plus two others are also following so i'm like okay i'll follow her or no i'll let her follow me and then next thing i know uh she starts requesting to message me going like i forget exactly what she said but it was something along the lines of i was scrolling on instagram and this is all like broken english it's like i was scrolling through instagram and i saw your profile and you i thought you looked cool and and again this is all broken english so it was probably more like I was scrolling Instagram, you look cool, saw so follow you. And so she mentioned me that and I'm like, um, okay. And then keeps going on and on and on. And I ask, uh, okay, uh, what made you want to follow me? And then she asks, completely skips the question. Uh, how old are you and what do you do for a living? I'm like, um, I'm 20. Uh, I work at the Kroger. Um, I hate myself. But again, what made you want to follow me? And this keeps going on and on and on keeps dodging the question she goes oh i'm 20 i'm a forest i live in miami or i'm i speak french i was like but then she sends me a message about going oh what are you doing right now and, I was, and i'm just like trolling her doing this for you no know, poops and giggles and i said oh no i'm just laying down watching my uh, my favorite lisa ann movie my favorite johnny sins movie you know the normal and then she messaged i'm laying in bed looking sexy and comfortable would you want to chat with me? And I'm just like, there's no way, there's no way, there's no way. And so I said, sure. I knew damn well this is now, this is a, a porn account because there's no way, like I know uh, there are no girls this hoary enough that are that will randomly follow people and they'll message them, send me, I'll send you boot pics, because trust me, I've met some thoughts in my day, and even they don't even do that crap. She goes, send me messages through, add me on Google Hangouts, and we will talk through there. And that's when I knew, like, this is a scam. Because why don't you just send me the pictures on Instagram? Huh? <gasps> Gives me your email. And so, 
I made sure, very sure, to use an email that I never use, an email that has no credit cards saved to it. It was my old email that I used back in high school, my old, uh, old MM student account. I used that one, you know, with my profile picture as a uh, Walter from Drake and Josh. And so I measured my, like, hey, I say, oh, howdy, you are alone. How do you know that? Huh? Huh? I will show you my breast. I'll do like me some fried chicken. I like old breast with some tandies. Yeah, that's nice. And my... And you will show me your beautiful cock. But I want it to stay between us. Are you okay? Oh, uh, okay. Okay, call me video and show me your face. And you will see me sing. And so I do call her. I do a video chat because I was curious. You know, at first I thought, you know, it's probably going to be like, you know, some like Indian dude and with glasses on a computer. And, uh, but no, it was actually a girl. And But I could still tell it was fake because the video looked like it was shot in like 2003. It was like in like, what, like 240p with like some, you know, it was a naked girl. But like it was so laughably like you could tell it was old because in the background because not only was the video quality crap you could see like a crt tv in the background which i mean and it was so funny because you know in in the google chat you know on the main screen you could i see like this one girl you know just doing this doing that taking a uh um a, a you know what and uh doing that it's so funny because you see that but in the little corner you can see my face i'm just sitting there just like open cam can you see me wow you are very beautiful open cam so if you don't want to show yourself on cam goodbye and i uh i did because yeah i did you literally just said i looked beautiful okay so you're already contradicting yourself like, I know, again, I know this is a scam, but, like, come on, like, this is, like, show your cock now, and I'll show you my tits and my shaved show cock now. I did not see anything. Show cock now. I'm like, dang, man, like, is this what it's, like, after, like, she's, like, three or four times told me to show her my private area, I'm just like, yeah, like, did I just get sexually assaulted through the internet you know now i feel like that one girl and and plumbers don't wear ties where i'm the little girl and, and she's like that one fat dude take your damn clothes off and to that point i was like uh no and i immediately thought to some good old advice that i learned from good old reznov do you honestly think a girl wants a photo of your penis because she's going to pleasure herself to it no it's blackmail, Mason. Never forget that.